Sima <laughs> Mine was maybe younger than yours. <laughs> very, very bitter. Uh, my name is Philemon. Uh, I'm um, the director of Ntua Services. Uh, Ntua is a company <clears throat> that uh, runs a mobile based application that helps users to access transport services. Uh, either uh, to transport, uh, you know, either passengers or produce uh, goods to uh, market. So we've of recent we have adapted our system to start working with farmers uh, who are dealing in different uh, uh, agricultural activities. And uh, our model is to really work with uh, farmer groups uh, which are organized and uh, are producing in bulk and uh, be able to like uh, connect them to affordable, uh, reliable and convenient transport services to transport their produce to the, the, uh, the preferred uh, market sectors. Tuha, um, our colleagues implementing the inclusive, <laughs> inclusive agricultural markets program. Sorry, we use too many acronyms, so the actual <laughs> names can be quite difficult at times. But I think what is so special about this activity um, in the United States, I'm so pleased to support it through um, our U.S. Agency for International Development. It was responding to a need that originated in the community. So the farmers needed a way to get their produce to market. And Tua had an idea. People came together. And in the months that this has been working, you've just seen it grow and has like a trickle-down effect. And it's, you know, providing income particularly to young people. It's using technology, which I think is just fantastic to, to merge technology and agriculture. Um, lots of women involved. And so I think the potential for this to continue to grow and to make a difference in people's lives is enormous. And we're glad to be a part of this process. Um, we're glad to, to support something that, as we say, was homegrown. And I think that's the right thing to say when you're talking about agriculture. And to see so many young people involved, and as I said, to see so many women involved. So the, the impact is tremendous. It's raising incomes. You know, so many people, their lives have been negatively affected by the pandemic, and this is addressing that need. And it's not just something to respond to the current health crisis that the world is experiencing. This is something long-term that will make a long-term difference in people's lives.